What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with another movie. Today we are doing Howl's Moving Castle. Came out in 2004, another Ghibli classic. I know nothing about this whatsoever besides that I love the soundtrack. I have heard it a couple of times. Remember to check out the Patreon if you guys want early access by a week on the movies and the full uncut versions. Check out the Twitch if you guys want two weeks of early access. We watch these live before they even go on Patreon. I'm not going to waste any more time. Howl's Moving Castle uh, came out in 2004 in the sub. Japanese audio. Let's do it. All right. We are starting the movie off with what I presume is Howl's Moving Castle. The one thing that I will always expect and always have expected is some beautiful hand 2D animation. Now, I haven't heard the whole soundtrack. This is primarily the only song I've heard from this movie but it's one of my favorite Ghibli songs. I'm not gonna lie, design-wise, we got airplanes, what the? I do know the Ghibli movies are like never really connected. They're all based on their own setting, their own lore. I always need to reevaluate during each one where we're at timeline-wise, what sort of technologies do we have? What sort of supernatural world are we in? I love each and every Ghibli movie I've seen. And I've only seen two. She looks like she's going to buy some drugs around the corner. Looking for her secret plug. Is my man Do Flamingo? Why the hell do these weird mud men have cool looking top hats or these little fucking gentlemen's hats? What movie am I watching? Oh, that would be so cool. I've seen this clip before, like this gif. I love how his jacket sleeves make him look like an airplane. Imagine how cool that would be walking on air. How is she not in the slightest bit freaked out that there was mud men coming out of the wall and were floating on air? <laughs> Don't just say that's my girl, Mr. Rizman. That's a beautiful song. Who in the hell is this? Again? With the last movie I just watched and a classic with Ghibli movies, is they don't give you any sort of necessary needed exposition or lore. You're thrown right into this world and you pick up on what's going on and you pick up the pieces. Ooh, that could be the Witch of Waste. She looks like she could summon some met mud men. Hey, don't call my hats cheap. Girl, where are you hiding all them funds in that neck roll? Don't start with me, girl. I'm saying, please leave. Oh, so she put a spell on us, and the guy who saved us earlier was Hal. And so now, knowing that Hal is probably going to come back for... Sophie, an old lady now? Oh, oh, she did her dirty. Oh, did her dusty. That's me when I wake up every morning. I'm like, what the fuck? I'm old now? Nah, the Witch of the Waste did her dusty. I gotta beat her up if I see her. If anyone catches her, they're like, oh, I'm sorry, miss. Do you need a hat or something? Are you lost? Let me help you along your way. Oh. saying this war is going to be terrible we haven't won the war yet we're going to war that's why this letty said we live in dangerous times and just like that sophie is dipping it 
There's something on the other end of that stick. Oh, it's a scarecrow. What on earth is going on? Oh, it gives us the cane. Well, thank you. <laughs> you funny old lady. And now he's repaid his debt. And now he walks off. Yeah, imagine how much of a bodily change that would feel like. Like, I feel like my body's changing too fast and I'm living it normal. Imagine you go from 20 to 80 overnight. Like, your body would be aching. That is Howl's Moving Castle. <laughs> yeah, can you bring me a house to sleep in? He's like, I brought you one. Like, it reminds me of uh, Seven Deadly Sins. Uh, Hawk's Mom. We have a bar, you know? Hey. We knew you for a, literally about two minutes. Weird scarecrow turnip head guy. You may be a turnip. But you're a good turnip. May you scare many crows and live a very fruitful scarecrow life. Calcifer. I don't know if I trust you. <laughs> yeah. Interesting. A fire demon calcifer. Such a such a granny thing to do. The great wizard Jenkins. So wizards and witches are like a thing. Like it's not like a something that's questionable or somewhat believed in. It's like a real thing. So she walked up the door in Howl's Moving Castle. And then she's at a building in town. He's passing off as a wizard. <laughs> I love how that little kid can put on like an old man beard dis disguise. Are you telling me that door, depending on what color, accesses other doors? Is that why he said Port Haven? He's going to open the door and be shocked at, at, like, teleports. We're in Port Haven now. Uh, yeah, a water city. He's got to put it right back on. So it's not Port Haven this time, it's Kingsbury. So we're under the disguise of different aliases and names. We have Pendragon, who's like Arthur Pendragon. We have... Jenkins, and now we're not in Port Haven anymore. Oh, this is such a cool concept. This is such a cool concept. This place is really not well taken care of. Black, which is where Howl is from. I like how the light changes too. It's so crazy. <laughs> Galsiver eats the eggshells. Yummy. Yummy. Even the way they animate the food. They go so OD with the animation. Markle. Very dirty house. Ooh, that boy Mark. Oh, he's twaxing. Ooh. We do know ooh, we do know the witch of waste is after how so he said ancient magic and powerful as well but he's also very powerful 
Like, I hate that old... She cursed me. I can't say it. Ah. That's That'd be so frustrating you can't say it. <laughs> you talk your shit, Sophie. <sighs> that is me when I'm cleaning. Oh my god, do the people in this house let this place get crazy. Don't get me started. I'm not gonna lie. This man howls a gorgeous man. Got the earrings, the hair. The blue eyes. As he goes into the demon world. What the fuck? Talk about a beautiful area to be in. I wouldn't mind having a, a, a cabin. A house right there on the water. Next to the wildlife and the forest. I'm much more of a country guy. If I had to choose between the city and a country, even though my job is an online content creator, I would I would really rather choose the country. Oh my god, it's the legend. It's the legend. He's called Turnip Turnip Head. So we got our gang of Markle, Sophie, and Turnip Head. As we're scouring the land, I want to know Sophie's goal. Obviously, Hal's a wizard who could help us. We're looking for the Witch of the Waste. So cute. What are we going to do when we see her, though? Okay, and now we see bird form Hal. What the? Is this the war that's going on? That, that fucking airplane just shot out demons. The hell is going on in this movie? He's like, I'm back from demon shit land. Pick up my talons and sit back for a second. I like how a natural fire would say that about a man made fire, you know? How is not the how we know right now. Mm, that must cut deep for her, because why is she living if she's an old, ugly lady right now? Understandable. Oh, turnip head. A lot of the built up anger is hitting Sophie of being forced to work at the hat shop, never considering herself pretty. Her sister Letty being gorgeous, and you know, this. Respect to Sophie for. Uh, there's definitely been times where you get. For me, specifically, you get a little depressed, you have yourself a nice, let out all that anger, and then you snap back into it. You know, you got shit you gotta get done. Shout out Sophie for not giving up, working on how. Shout out Markle. Very interesting design room he has. Yeah, uh, that's kind of a crazy thing. Yeah, 
マダムタリマンも諦めてくれるかもしれない What's on a ring just like how has Okay I love how classic 20s 30s I don't know the exact contemporary time piece for like outfits like this it feels very old school but still very modern in a very twisty kind of way with the technology they have like look at that that's so weird meanwhile the blob men are right there Look how big she is in the little. Oh, left two marks right there. Or maybe those two marks right there. Prev Interesting. <laughs> what the They don't have like a magic liposuction spell or something, or a magic treadmill spell or something. Gotta have some magic Ozempic. <laughs> Over here cheering her on. Gambare! And you call yourself a witch. She literally falls into herself. What in the hell is going on? A demon stole his heart. Interesting. <laughs> to her real age. とても素晴らしい魔法使いです。王国は三河な神話的な世界。オッケー。オッケー。Sophie is not afraid to talk her shit. As she gets younger, the more she denies her love, the more old she gets. She turned young there just for a second. I like that. Is that Ubo's voice actor? That sounds like Blackbeard. That's a hundred percent Blackbeard's voice actor. Yeah, Soliman is very powerful. That's crazy, but oh, that was how. Poor bro, so much going on. Get the witch of the what the f this is some beautiful animation for 2004 holy mother of jesus what is going on bro i need to do drugs and watch this scene Thank the Lord he gracefully landed us there. What in the... <sighs> what the fuck is going on? So, I would have never expected half the things we have in this movie, but now we're about to get a militaristic air dogfight? The ring will guide you. 
Now we're in Lord of the Rings. Glowing towards Calcifer. That's so cool. That's so cool. Better lock in, Sophie. Add a girl. Yeah, I thought all those were mini howls. Yeah. The door that doesn't connect. Oh, I love that magical aspect. That they're connected, but they're not connected. Just an abandoned house. Maybe you eat us? Oh. Okay. Talk about a way to stick the landing. Uh-oh. Is it howl in bird form? I'm curious how both of them are going to break their spells. See, I'm curious that we haven't gotten any Markle story at all. Like, who is he to how? The Witch of the Waste is like down to her basic functionalities now. She's like a primal beast, you know? Everyone in our little family is complicated. Magic is crazy. Now it's a completely different interior. I wonder, is the exterior changed at all? We're definitely not in the waste still. Where are we at? I wonder what it is specifically about her spell. Because look, like she's somewhat younger right here, you know? I'm telling you, I need a door like that. Talk about a view. Talk about pretty. I could have a I could have a cabin right there and live out the rest of my days. Alright, free run, I see you. You're like Flame. Flame's favorite spell was creating a field of flowers. Honestly, yeah, that would be like a magical paradise. Like, I need to know the very specifics of her spell. It's like when she loses self confidence, or as it flies right over. Such interesting designs for battleships. All bombs ready to be dropped. So weird when they shoot out in wizards or whatever deputies yeah that just turn into demon f <laughs> so elegantly graceful <laughs> for how dirty For how dirty the Witch of Waste did, Sophie. Sophie is very compassionate. <laughs> I 
air raid siren don't just immediately cut to the battlefield like that jesus i've been told if i watch grave of the fireflies i will undoubtedly cry and it'll be one of the saddest movies i've ever watched this is the most weird impromptu family i've ever seen a random wizard boy uh, a beautiful man who's gonna turn into a demon bird at any time our uncle fire calcifer sophie the nurse old lady young woman in love the old nice mean okay like this is the craziest family i've ever seen <laughs> Air raids are never a pretty thing. Bruh, this is getting... Eerie. At first I thought the entire antagonist was going to be the Witch of the Waste. Now it's Sol Suleiman and War and... What the... F this is just... Good, use some magic. Get them the fuck out of here. Yeah, Calcifer, uh, I see smoke, but... He's barely holding on. One thing I also like, because there's no explanation needed. They don't tell you why these humans or people are going to war. Because there's never, ever in actual life, like a really good reason, you know? You can go to war over gasoline and go to war over dog food, you know? I just like how they don't touch on that at all. I don't know what is going on. Turn up, bro. What is Turn up? Just been a random cool ass side character. Oh, we don't need any explanation on him either. Getting rid of the house is a crazy concept, but you gotta move forward, you know. Imagine, it, yeah, how with the rain? How is that gonna work? Do we cover him? It literally got eaten up as a dimensional pocket. It's so weird. He really was the glue that kept the moving castle together. Shout out Markle. He doesn't get enough credit. Okay, bouncy granny. Obi-Wan, Kelsifer, you're my last hope. You're my only hope. Oh, yeah, like a, a deal with the devil. Gotta give up something to yourself. All right, Kelsifer. He is strong. I can't blame him. How many intricacies put this place together and keep this place intact? He's just free. Oh, it's like a mini version. Owl's moving two bedroom apartment. And without Calcifer, this whole spot falls apart. Uh huh. Sophie is incredibly dead, and that's the end of this movie. Sad way to go out, but... <laughs> what is this movie? Oh, Calcifer's still alive in that ring, maybe? Light does point to Calcifer. This dog is trying to tell you something. Yeah, that's just nothing but blackness. Is that the black door that we've never officially gone through? He's like, no, nah, I'm good. I'm not going through that. Eh, fuck it. <laughs> fuck it. This 
so weird to think about the stars dancing, falling, fluttering, and running. Hey, just note to self, if we ever catch a star, let's not eat it. That would... Is that the deal he, he took his heart out for Calcifer? So that ominous black void. Could it have been a bending of time and space? Could it have been specifically just that memory of Hal? Like, we don't need to know. I'm curious, though. Okay, so now Hal's gonna pull up with Sophie and Heen. Still got Granny, Markle, Turnip, and an almost dead Calcifer. Come on, Granny. <laughs> Come on, Granny. Give me his heart. Because it was... He was a child when he get, did that deal, you know? <laughs> that broke the contract, binding Calcifer to Howl in the castle. <laughs> now we don't have Calcifer controlling the, <laughs> our movements anymore. Turnip is sacrificing himself to stop us from falling and saving our lives. <laughs> I'll get you a new stick right away. Imagine a random... What is it? The princess and the frog? As soon as we kiss him, he goes back to normal? Lit princess and the scarecrow. It's a heavy burden. That's a bar. Um, <laughs> I like the song playing right now. This movie is absolutely nothing of what I expected. And now Heen's calling it a soul. And like, hey, look what I did. I just stopped the war, girly. Look at that, huh? Huh? Look at that. You two timer. <laughs> Alright, turn it, man. Oh. Hey. Now we're Hal's flying castle. We got Granny, Heen, Markle. It looks like she's wearing our hat. We got a new hat. Absolutely not what I was expecting in the slightest. But a very beautiful movie. Wow, wow, wow. Another Ghibli movie off the checklist okay in terms of the movie there are certain expectations when you go into a ghibli film that were absolutely met of mine those expectations are beautiful soundtrack beautiful animation very 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 unique lore characters world and setting which is all that and just completely unexpectedness and that's that's completely what i've got from the Witch of the Waste turning into Granny from meeting Markle and Hal to the concept of magic in this world and, and them having a political war going on in the background all while trying to figure out who we are, what we want, and what our place is in this world. You know, it's a great movie. Wow. 
I think my favorite character, I love Sophie. I love characters that are just, uh, I don't know, compassionate and empathetic beyond a measure of a doubt, you know? Like, I really enjoyed Sophie. I really enjoyed Markle. How surprisingly, Howl's not my favorite character of this. I, I think Sophie and Markle are probably my favorite characters, but overall, great movie. Fair, I think it's my favorite soundtrack of any Ghibli film yet. I loved it. I loved it. Um, yeah, make sure you guys check out the Patreon if you guys want early access by a week to the movies, the full length version. Check out the Twitch to watch these live with us. Always an experience, it's always a vibe watching this live with you guys. Don't forget to drink some water. Tell someone you love them, because you never know when they might give their heart away to a demon. Uh, take care, Dapper Squad.